hey guys welcome back to the vlog i hope you're doing fabulous today as you can see i'm kind of i'm dressed up makeup done i found the cutest little coffee shop on instagram and i'm going there today to get some work done i have a vlog to upload and some other things that i need to work on so i didn't want to stay locked up in the apartment and i didn't want to look crackety at all i wanted to look a little bit put together so i got cutesy we're going to go to the coffee shop check it out it looks so cute like the girls dress up in like tea time attire very costumey but still very nice and i think they do like floral arrangements things like that but on the weekend so it's like a brunchy spot if i like it today then i'll go back and do brunch and check it out but today i just want to work anyway i just wanted to start off the vlog if you're new over here welcome welcome home I'm Alicia Kim. Sit back, relax, enjoy this vlog, and then I get caught up with some older ones so we can get more familiar with each other. And to my big up crew, Guan Du Did Du. You know my love you already, right? I'm gonna show you my outfit and everything. I got some new jewelry in. Look at this earring, guys. The cutest little earring, right? So all my jeweler today, except for my watch, is from Ana Luisa. So thank you so much to Ana Luisa Jewelry for sponsoring this portion of today's video. If you've been following me, you know I've been rocking with Ana Luisa for years at this point. For example, this necklace I've had for years, about three years. And it's still holding up. It looks brand new. It has not tarnished. It upholds its quality. So you can get top quality pieces from them they are so chic so modern but at the same time timeless as well they are having a sale up to 30 percent off so i'm going to be linking the website in the description of this video go ahead and check it out i know with it being fall we're all trying to change up our look change up our aesthetic so i'd say grab a few drill your pieces to add that pop to your outfits like i'm doing today i'll show you my outfit very soon but look at this one that i got as well guys this little mini chunky hoop so cute and then i also got this as well this is new to the collection this bracelet so dainty and of course this earring so unique so chic i will be leaving the link to the website in the description so go ahead and check that out thank you again to anna luisa for sponsoring this portion of today's video okay so i'm wearing this vest with some oversized jeans and then my ballet flats personally i love that Ballet flats are back in there, so comfortable, and you can get them in so many different colors. For my fragrance, I'm going to be doing Jessica Simpson Fancy. It's this, I think this is a fall scent. It's okay. Guys, tell me why. Tell me why the place closed. Tell me why I'm on my way to Dunkin Donuts to get a matcha. Tell me why. Apparently today they open half day or something like that and I just took too long to get ready. So they're closed and I'm on my way to Dunkin's to get myself a matcha. And yeah, I think I'm just going to go to the mall and make a day out of it because my plans have been derailed hey one thing jersey traffic nothing to play with but it was so funny to me to show up at a place and it <laughs> it closed i am dressed and i'm telling you about this cute little spot that i'm going and all of that and to know it's not going to happen but yeah it is what it is okay let me do the pumpkin spice iced medium with almond milk please okay that's it? Yes. Can you grab it? Okay. First fall drink of the season. Pumpkin spice iced latte from Dunkin. So, this is it. I'm just mixing it. Ooh! Strong. I'm most tasting coffee, not pumpkin. And I want to taste the pumpkin. Yeah, I'm not tasting the pumpkin. It's a three pumpkin swear, but I'm little, no pumpkin at all. No, let me mix it round. Yep, straight coffee. Anyway, let's 
head to the mall let's go do some girly things tip so <laughs> it's embarrassing so i wasn't able to you know i always complain about putting on my bracelets by myself i saw this hack on tiktok to say put the tape on my wrist and then latch it that way and it worked the hack worked but tell me why the tape itch up on my bag to embarrass me trip was fun 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 i'm about to head home right now my phone battery is dead uh yeah i did secure a bag one of the bags that i was showing you i showed you the little bucket bag and then i showed you the tabby comment down below and let me know which one you think i got tell me why i was getting so much compliments on my teddy blake bag so many compliments especially in the coach store because i was wondering why no one was saying anything to me about recording i was just vlogging and recording i wasn't talking though but i had my camera out usually you go in the store and you have your camera out you're like oh no recording da, 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 da. one of the workers came up to me and she asked me are you a youtuber so i told her yes and uh yeah no problems then one other guy came to me and he's like is that a kelly i'm like no sir i look like me a kelly money me look like me can't afford Kelly, but no, yeah. The Kelly is how much? What, 30, 40,000 or more US dollars? Mm -mm. So maybe they thought it was a Kelly, and that is why they allowed me to record because they say, oh, that girl going to be spending. <laughs> hey guys, good morning. It's another day in the vlog, and I am headed to a dance class. <laughs> Listen. If you know me, you have never seen me dance. You have never seen Kim dancing because I don't dance. I cannot dance. I can bust a one wine. Yeah, I can do a little one wine and so, you know, I'm a Caribbean girl. Anyway, I decided it's all about new things, newness, trying new things. For the rest of the year, we made that promise, right? So I found this dance class and I decided I'm going to take it. And see how I like it. I also want to add different workout routines, regimens, and styles into my to get me hyped again about working out and all of that. So I'm just trying new things over here. I know I may look sleepy, but yeah, it's early. Made it with five minutes to spare, so I'm early and I just had to parallel park. I hate parallel parking, even though I can do it. It gives me anxiety for some reason because the traffic, the cars are coming and they are not stopping while I am trying to back in. Um, yeah, I made it, so let me go in, get signed up and settled for this class. I need to get a gym bag. Look at the bag that I'm carrying to my workouts. I need to buy a little bag. Um, a little gym bag. Anyway, let's go see what this. Oh, I took up the camera. Let me put this band on because I didn't even fix my lace because I know it's going to sweat out. <laughs> Guys, that class, it was fun, but it beats, it beat me bad. <laughs> because coordination is not something, it's, I told you, 
when it comes to dancing and routine, I am not the best at it. And she was just adding on, adding on, adding on, and adding on. But I made it to the end. I did my best. And in the end, we stopped and we were talking, me and the instructor. And she was saying that I did really well because they've been practicing this routine for a whole month. So everyone was basically familiar with the routine. And she was just adding on this week's portion. So she was like, I was looking back there at you and I'm saying, okay, she's, she's, she's catching on. I'm like, all right, I don't feel that bad right now. I think the next, if I'm doing another dance class though, I would do a hip hop type of dance or if I can find hip hop class or if I can find a dance hall class, that would be good. But yeah, I'm happy I, I got up really early and I made it here and I'm just so thankful. Thank you, God. Thank you so much for waking me up this morning for allowing me to have a sound mind a healthy body i'm able to make it to this class and move my body i may not be the most coordinated however i'm still thankful that i have health and strength and the ability to do things like this especially in this new environment this new city like how blessed am i that Despite everything that I'm going through, I still have a joy, a peace, and a happiness in my heart. I'm still able to wake up and see the day and experience life for what it is. I'm so thankful. So thankful for that. And in the end, she said to us, make three wishes. One for yourself, one for a loved one, and one for the world. And of course... <laughs> I I made those three wishes. I just wish for the world, though, that we can all live in peace and harmony, you know? And I just wish for people that are experiencing extreme poverty that things can be better away, where the wealth can be distributed in such a way that the kids and the people, they don't have to experience that. The wealth in the world can spread among the population that's that's my wish my the wish for myself i'm going to keep that to myself but god say i know everything and him know he knows what what's on my heart but yeah i'm so thankful that i was able to wake up do this class i'm happy that i'm out i'm exploring i'm doing new things i'm trying new things i feel really really good anyway i think let me see if I can find a coffee shop or somewhere because now I'm hungry. I danced out. Ooh, I, I, only thing I had this morning was a cup of tea and I danced that out. I need food. I'm hungry. Back home, I was going to do an acai bowl, but I just decided I'm going to do a protein shake. Grab a shower, get ready because I have a sponsorship that I need to do for TikTok. So I need to just go get ready, get myself together. And do that but this is the protein it's a protein shake and it's a it's elevation in the chocolate fa flavor so i'm doing working for the day i worked on the video and so the video itself let me tell you how many seconds because i had to post it it was such a rush they're like they're going on vacation tomorrow so i have to record pause and do invoice so much in a short space of time she apologized. She's like, I'm so sorry for putting this on you so quickly, but we really, really need this sponsorship done. And, you know, it, it has to be quick because we're going on vacation. And I'm like, okay, I will do what needs to be done. So the video itself is 43 seconds, but I had to record it. I had to put in a green screen type of thing. Then I had to edit it today. I had to send it over to them for approval. It was just a lot, but I do see why a lot of people, instead of doing YouTube, they just focus on short form content because it's quick, it's easy. It's easier than YouTube. And it's literally a 43 seconds video, less than a minute, and your job is done. So. I do see why people don't even bother <laughs> with YouTube because trust, YouTube is a lot of hard work. You have to be dedicated, you have to be consistent, and you have to be in love with it because it's not a get quick, rich, get 
rich quick thing yeah it's not a get rich quick thing you have to be dedicated and really create people that love you love your content love your vibe love something about you and keep coming back whereas on the other apps like say TikTok, you can go viral just like that and you're out there no you're the biggest you're the next biggest thing look at the demure person whereas youtube you're in for it you're in for the ride you're in for investing in editing creating and sometimes you don't even get the views or the traction or the money that you anticipate but you have to do it because you love it so if you're a new creator I would say work on those other platforms because they are lucrative but YouTube is really where if you want to build a community and you're really passionate about creating content and things like that YouTube is the place for me personally I love YouTube I love my big up crew and that's why I put on my big up crew shirt today because I'm like yeah I love my big up crew and I love the sense of community that is here on YouTube. Um, now I need to cook some food. So let me know if you like when I include my cooking in my videos. I, I love to cook. It's a therapy for me. I love to cook. I like to take my time and I like to plate my food and I like when it looks delicious and inviting and appetizing. I, I love that. So let me know if you like when I include it or not because I can just not include it or I can include it more so just let me know but I'm going to be making some stuffed bell peppers today that's my new obsession so I have some peppers that I've cut and was using here and there so I'm like let me make that for dinner today and I have I have this one too so I'm going to just cut this in two and use it and remember I bought grown turkey so I have that I'm going to make a big batch of the grown turkey and I'm going to separate it and add cauliflower rice to the portion that I'm going to put in the peppers because I want to bulk it up then I'm going to add a little mozzarella cheese get that nice and melted in the oven and that will be din din so let's start the cooking good morning well good afternoon it's 12 22 it's the next day in the vlog and i'm here packing my work bag because we are going to be working today i have videos i need to edit i have emails i need to respond to i have calls i need to make i have a lot to get done today and remember we were supposed to why did the bag fall it down remember we were supposed to go to a coffee shop when the vlog just started we're going there today that's where i am headed and remember how cute i got dressed up and all of that today i'm just in a such shirt and some leggings because it's cold outside i'm cold and i'm a little bit moody to be honest i'm not in the best mood today i got up from 5 30 this morning because i had a 7 30 a.m workout class don't ask me who told me to choose a class that early in the morning huge mistake 
huge huge mistake because i had to get up so early and then when i went to the instructor she was she's definitely not a morning person because she was like i said good morning and she's like take this take this space right here you know and then throw the class and she was just not she wasn't rude, but she wasn't given the vibe you need early in the morning. You do need a ray of sunshine early in the morning to get you going. But hey, we all have our days. I'm having a day. She may be having a day. I can't use that to judge her at all. The good thing is I'm still going to get some work done, still be productive, and ignore how I feel. Because if I... If I... Pay attention to how I feel, I would stay and rot in the apartment today and that's the reason i'm even leaving and going out because if i stay here i know i'm not going to be productive i'm going to sleep and just not worry but focus on things that i don't i should not be focusing on so i'm taking you with me and we're going to hang out because whenever i, I have you it's good vibes you keep the good vibes flowing. I'm telling you, whenever this camera is out, I put my best foot forward. And this is what I'm wearing. Just this sweatshirt that you saw that I got from Timo. The leggings from Amazon. And then these clogs that I got from Timo as well. My work bag. Amazon. You guys always ask me about it. It's Amazon. So I'm done working for the day. The cafe, so cute, so feminine. It's all girly things. It's flowers and pinks and very, very feminine. And it's black owned as well and woman owned. So that's really good. I got my usual iced matcha latte and he did two pumps of vanilla. I just wish he didn't froth it so much. They had a food menu as well, like a brunchy kind of menu, pancakes, waffles, things like that. So I liked it. I think it's a nice space. As I was telling you, it's somewhere that it's a brunchy vibe. So like on the weekend, I can imagine music playing and it's just feminine energy right through. So then when I was done, working i got the feminine urge to <laughs> go get a pedicure done so i did that and yeah that is how the day is going so far girls what do we do when we're feeling sad class what do we do when we're feeling down we go walk up and down in our favorite store <laughs> right i am going inside tj maxx to Get some therapy, some free therapy. Him come out strong, dump him. Listen, that's one thing I am not telling anyone to do. Leave them man or them woman. I love the color, so cute. These are nice, but I don't like the heel. TJ Maxx did what it needed to do. I didn't buy a thing. I just window shopped, tried on shoes, looked at clothes, looked at home decor, and I'm feeling so much better. So see, don't really have to spend money to get the retail therapy, right?